Do trees really talk? Have you heard that trees talk to each other? We already knew that they are whispering, making hums, or murmuring. But we didn't know, until recently a German and a Canadian forester said that, trees speak to each other. If you think this is absurd, you are not alone. When we first heard that trees talk, we too, were highly skeptical. Today we bring you to Mount Hood National Forest to get close to trees. Our dog Roxy, a great Pyrenees is with us and protects us from cougars, mountain lions and wolves because they can show up here. A forester said that to understand how trees talk, the first step is to know that trees are in a network. This forest is much more than what we can only see above ground. Trees communicate underground with their root system. How? You might say. Through mushrooms, called mycelium. Some foresters calls it the wood wide web. Trees share water and nutrients through the networks, and also use them to communicate. The next time you walk in the forest, think about that just a few inches below your feet, is a tree communication web. These trees are interconnected through an underground fungal network. Scientists are only just beginning to learn the language of trees but many experts remain skeptical about trees talking to each other. Foresters also say, that in the forest, trees have a, mother, tree, or hub tree. The mother trees are the oldest and the tallest. One mother tree can connect with hundreds of trees. Amazingly the mother tree nurtures their young. They are recognizing their own kin. For example, when alarmed, mother can send them more carbon underground if needed. Trees are dependent on each other. They are connected and working underground by sending nutrients to others. This underground connectivity, amazingly helps them to fight and survive diseases, drought, sun damage and insect attacks. They are helping the weak and the young, by sending more sugar and carbon. Even a dying tree sends messages to their kin to build up their defenses. This is how trees speak.
Talking trees appeared in many ant cultures and famous Hollywood movies. For examples, The Wizard of Oz, The Lord of the Rings, and The Tree of Life. We think they have feelings and can talk, but we also have to understand that trees are not like us. Why does it matter to know that trees talk to each other? Because we just can't cut trees aimlessly. We have to allow some trees to stay here forever and grow old. Since we heard about how trees talk, our forest walks entered into a new chapter. This forest became a magical place for us. We were full of wonder. We saw that trees are helping each other. Every year, more than four million people visit the Mount Hood area, making it one of the most visited national forests in the country. Besides tourism, forests like Mount Hood also provide the essential clean water for our communities. Oh, lastly, not to worry. We've never had to run from a bobcat or cougar or black bear or wolf. Thanks to Roxy.